Youth Med Ed, Medical Students Educating Youth. In this short video, we are going to talk about sexually transmitted infections, or STIs. First of all, what is an STI? STIs used to be called STDs, or sexually transmitted diseases. An STI is an infection caused by bacteria, viruses, and parasites. There are more than 30 sexually transmissible bugs. When a person has sex with somebody infected, they may also develop an STI. Here are some common examples of STIs. Gonorrhea, Chlamydia, Genital Herpes, Genital Warts, Syphilis, HIV, and Hep B. Over 1 million people around the world acquire an STI each day. That's equal to about half the number of people living in Vancouver. How are STIs transmitted? To answer this, we must first talk about where these germs live in the body. They can be found in open wounds such as cuts and scrapes, in blood, and in semen and vaginal fluids. STIs can pass from one person to another through any kind of sexual activity and even through some non-sexual but intimate actions. Am I at risk for an STI? There are certain risk factors that make some people more likely to develop an STI than others. Having sex with anyone without using barrier protection such as condoms increases your chances of acquiring an STI. Using injectable drugs also puts you at risk. Some helpful tips to protect yourself from getting an STI include using a condom every time you have sex, including oral or anal sex. Vaccinations can also protect you. While birth control pills and IUDs are effective at preventing pregnancy, they do not protect you from STIs. It is important to ask your doctor to test you for STIs when you first decide to become sexually active as well as before being sexually active with someone new. It is a good idea to get retested every year or more frequently if you are at risk of having an infection even if you are sexually active with only one person. STI tests can be performed in your doctor's office to get a sample of the bug causing the infection. STI tests often include urine and blood samples as well as swabs taken from different parts of the body. There are treatments available to help manage STIs and many are curable. If an STI is confirmed, your doctor may prescribe you medications, offer you counseling, run additional tests, and offer you vaccinations to prevent other STIs. You should talk to your sexual partner or partners about how you can practice safe sex together and ask your doctor if you're at risk for STIs. Thank you for watching. Please like this video and subscribe to our channel for more educational videos.